I'll now show you how to use audio lanes to further organize your audio clips in the timeline. The first part of that is changing some colors. Looking at this timeline, it's not quite as easy to see as I would like, because currently I've got the same color in use for music as for dialogue. I'm just going to quickly head to Edit Roles and change music to something entirely different. Now it's a bit easier to see. I'm just going to deactivate these sub roles and press this button, Hide Audio Lanes, because though I didn't bring your attention to it earlier, we've got a whole new feature here called Audio Lanes. This is how an edit used to look in Final Cut. Audio is connected to clips. If it was in use, it was part of that clip. Separate audio is possible, but now with Audio Lanes, which is automatically activated if you choose to look at sub roles, will break apart the audio, including audio sections of clips for which the audio wasn't manually expanded, and you can see them all separately. What's also useful is you can rearrange these roles. So if you want to see the effects on top, that's fine. If you want to focus on music, drag that to the top. You can also choose to focus on just one role and then other roles are collapsed to tiny strips. Only one role can be focused on at any one time, and it doesn't have to be the one on top, so you don't have to rearrange them if you don't want to. Pressing that button once more causes all the roles to expand out and let you see them all at once. At any point, you can collapse the sub roles if you want to and expand one or more of the roles which have sub roles in play. You can hide audio lanes or show audio lanes. And whatever options you've chosen here, you can hide the timeline index and the audio lanes will stay active. This clip here is actually part of the video clip and you can edit just as you would normally. It is a slightly more complex way of working if you choose to work like this but if you're involved in complex audio turnovers for big jobs, you'll really appreciate the flexibility it gives you. Audio rolls also make your final mix a lot easier. And I'll show you that in the next video.